let's play some golf. We don't really talk about golf in Nigeria, but there are players that are exceptionally brilliant in golf. One of those guys, Oche Odo. Uh, the Professional Golfers Association of Nigeria, they have confirmed that Oche will be the country's only representative at the Kenyan Open. Um, some would say not good enough, but for me it's positive because you know what it can do, customers? It can motivate that next guy to see what our chair is doing, do it, and then before you know it, we'll have our guys playing at um, different competitions. Yes, certainly. I mean, Oche, uh, um, you need to look at the resilience of this guy. Mm. He's, he's been trying as much as possible to get there. And of course, you know, Tigers, that um, PGA Tour ranking. And where else can he get it? It's, uh, it, it just has to be in Kenya. Um, yes, he's going to represent the country. Mm. Uh, maybe he's just the only person and um, the fact that uh, golf is not particularly a popular sport in Nigeria. But certainly, you know, you keep doing this and he could compete with the best, you know, in Africa. And of course, um, with the world as well. So it's a good one. Mm -hmm. um, let him just go there. As I said, it's a matter of motivating the next guy to say that, okay, I can actually do this. That's what it is. Mm -hmm. This will be the fourth time uh, uh, Oche will be appearing at the event that is to take place on March 23rd to the 26th. This isn't just appropriate I'll listen to him. Let's listen to him. We'll be right back. Stay. Uh, in truth, I think that uh, uh, there's actually not much to prove around here anymore. I've, I've got over 30 wins in, in Nigeria already and, uh, and five, more, five more wins outside, outside Nigeria. So I think that uh, it's, it's really uh, for me, it's about going, going to the next level. It's about getting better and better. Because, uh, I mean, the big dream for me, the, my biggest dream is to play on the PGA Tour and actually become one of the top the best players in the world. So what I'm actually looking at doing right now is to focus and see what I can get out of this year on the Sunshine Tour. Because with the Sunshine, the Sunshine Tour presents you with a lot of opportunities, you know, because uh, they have some co-sanction events and also they've got all, almost all their events are actually have world ranking points. So if I can actually play hard and finish a high up there in most of uh, the events I'm going to be playing in, then it will do me a lot of good in terms of beefing up my world rankings and all.